in this Bose or web demo, we are doing a spatial voice app where by streaming both voice and location, we're able to spatialize the other person's voice based on their relative location. In this case, we're using Agora IO for the WebRTC stuff and the Residence Audio API for spatialization, where I'm taking the orientation data from the Bose AR device in the form of a quaternion and mapping that to the listener object and then taking the location of both myself and the other person I'm talking to. Right now, I'm just doing a call between my phone and the laptop, and I'm emulating my relative position to be at the uh, sprout, so that is over that way. That's why the audio is more in the right ear. And uh, by calculating the bearing angle, by doing a bunch of latitude, longitude calculations, uh, you can find out the relative location, uh, set that as the relative X and Z position, the resonance audio sound object, and then the person sounds like where they are relative to you. Uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, right now, I'm going to uh, have a bunch of preset locations. I'm going to change the location to the Caltrain station in San Antonio, which is going to be more to my left. So now you're going to hear my voice pan more to the left. And now you can see when I turn over to my left, or maybe, yeah, it's over there. Uh, you can see my, that my voice is now coming more from in front of me because that's where the location of that station is. Um, this is pretty cool. You can use it for knowing where your friends are, um, finding your Uber by panning either. I'm not sure you want to have a voice call with your Uber driver when they're coming over. That's usually when you get pissed. Um, but you can pan whatever existing audio you have, like your music, podcasts, audiobooks, um, for whatever purposes, you know. Um, I like to hear what ideas you guys have. I have a huge list, but there's like a two-minute limit on Twitter, so I better go end this video now.